Hello my friends, today we're gonna react to the 12th episode of Avatar The Last Airbender. Okay, let's just get into it. Earth, fire, air, yes! Long ago, the four nations, they lived together in harmony. Then the fire nation attacked, fire nation attacked. Sometimes it's not really good because causes some war. The new Avatar, an Avatar, not an Avatar, an airbender named Aang. So many words that start with A. Airbender, Avatar, Aang. Oh yeah! Avatar's Last Airbender, Book 1, Water, Chapter 12, The Storm. This show has such simple titles. This is a weird angle. And what's with the music? It's really calming, but it's a little creepy. Whoa, what's with the really dark clouds? Is he dreaming or something? Everything's happening so quickly. It's weird. Yeah, I think he's dreaming. He's seeing all different types of people. And now he's underwater somehow. Yeah. Had a nightmare. Oh, Katara says that he's been having a lot of nightmares lately. It's such a difficult position for the whole world to be depending on you to establish peace, to stop all the war, and learn all this crazy stuff that you have to learn in a really short period of time. Oh, and here's the Fire Nation ship with Prince Zuko and his uncle. A storm is approaching from the north, says the uncle. Which is probably true because the episode's called Storm. Wow! Zuko's like, the safety of the crew doesn't matter. Oh, he's saying the Avatar is way more important than any one person's safety. The captain of the ship is probably gonna be angry at this. <laughs> Katara's like testing the watermelon, seeing if it's all right. Everyone's talking about the storm. There's gonna be a bad storm. Mm, yeah, the uncle was right about the storm. Prince Zuko's so full of himself. He's like telling the other guy, respect me or I'll teach it to you. Prince Zuko, too much ego. Ah! He said, what should I expect from a spoiled prince? They're gonna fight. <laughs> After a bowl of noodles, Everyone will feel much better. Yep, the noodles of wisdom. Oh, the boy with tattoos. Everyone can recognize him as the avatar. What is the point of being the avatar if everyone can tell just from looking at you? Yeah, Aang doesn't turn his back on people. Oh, oh man, Aang is feeling so guilty about the hundred years of suffering that the world has had because he hadn't been there. Is Aang in this cave? Oh. He doesn't want to talk about it. His voice is so sad. Oh, he's remembering the day when he was told that he was the Avatar. Wow, he was super skilled even then. Though well, obviously he was chosen to be Avatar. Oh, he's gonna be told now. Wait, so are all those old men the Avatar? The previous Avatars? Because they all have the Avatar arrow tattoo on their heads. Oh, he picked these four toys when he was little out of thousands. And these are the Avatar toys that you pick, I guess. Hmm, so he was told that he was an avatar early. Usually he would have been told when he was 16. Now he's gonna talk about Zuko and everything that he's been through. Prince Zuko. Wow, he looked so different back then. He didn't have that eye scar and his head was full of hair. Wow, he looked much more innocent. He was like super respectful and stuff. I guess we're gonna find out what made him turn into this really aggressive Prince Zuko that we know now. Oh, so Zuko actually stood up to the Fire Nation leader guy who wanted to use these soldiers just as a disciple distraction, right? He wanted to just let them be killed. So after Aang found out, everything began to change. What's going on? He can't play with the other kids. But it's just because he is called the Avatar. They're saying that he has an unfair advantage. But he's the same person. Like, he didn't change. So he's being excluded from his group of friends. Oh, and these elders are discussing if Aang should train or if he should play. But that guy was nice. That guy was saying that he can decide when Aang should play and when he should train. Oh, so Zuko would duo the other guy. Oh, it was not the general. Who was it? It was the Fire Lord. His own father. He had to battle his own father. Wow. Oh, this guy's saying that Aang should grow up as a normal boy. He should have fun, but also train. Should we do what's best for him or what's best for the world? Oh, and Aang heard all of this. You're deciding his future and he had no say about it. It made him really upset. Oh, did Aang actually run away? Wow, he got so upset about it, he ran away. Wow, and that's how he actually got into that bubble that lasted a hundred years. And he wasn't there to help because he ran away. It's interesting. Hmm, oh, Katara's so nice. Yeah, it was meant to be this way. You would have been killed if you had stayed alive back then. And Zuko was like really afraid of fighting his father. Oh, Prince Zuko's refusing. He's saying that he won't fight. Oh, 
and as punishment, he was banished. Things will never return to normal. That's interesting. The Avatar gives Zuko hope, but it's hope for a different reason. He lived a pretty difficult life as well, or at least that part of his life was difficult. All right, they're gonna go find Sokka. All right, Aang, let's go. Wow, the storm is getting pretty strong now. Oh, what is Prince Zuko gonna do? Oh, wow. He saved that guy from falling. Very good, Prince Zuko, very good. <gasps> oh, the Avatar and Prince Zuko might meet. Hey, Aang made it. Oh, what happened? Wow, there's this like huge wave behind them. Oh no, they're underwater. Yeah, Aang turned into that white avatar mode where his eyes get all creepy and stuff. All right, the storm settled down a little bit. Nice, they survived. Oh, but Prince Zuko and the avatar exchanged a little look. So Aang is saying that he's not gonna dwell on the past anymore. Oh, and the old man said, thank you. Thanks for saving my life. All right. <laughs> All right, and that was another episode of Avatar The Lost Airbender. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe so that you get notified for the new videos that I make. New videos come out every single day, ever. You're gonna wake up, you're gonna find new reaction videos waiting for you. It's gonna be awesome, so make sure to subscribe. So that's it, guys. My name is Shami, and I'll see you in the next video.